Hello and welcome to another booktube video from me Martha May Books and today I have for you my February TBR. Completely forgot what video I was filming. I'm filming my February TBR. I have actually this time written down some things in my little planner, books that I want to read so I hope that this time I won't have to write in the description books that I want to read because often I do that because I film the TBR and then I've remembered all of the books I was meant to read that month. Starting with the first book that I have to read in February we have The Two Towers by J.R.R. Tolkien. In January for my January TBR I had to read The Fellowship of the Ring because I'm doing a buddy read with my friend and in February we will be reading The Two Towers. I did really enjoy The Fellowship of the Ring but I did keep falling asleep whilst I was reading it so I'm hoping that this one's more exciting and if not I'll just go back to the audiobook and listen to it while I'm walking because there's less risk that I will fall asleep. This will be going on all month. The last one took us basically all of January to read so I'm not even sure we'll finish this in February. If I would stop falling asleep every time I open the book then we might read it faster but that hasn't happened yet. The next book that I want to read in February is one that I actually don't know what it is yet. It is my next Mr. B's book. So I have a subscription to Mr. B's which is an independent bookshop in Bath. I will be reading a book that I get sent from Mr. B's at some point in February, but I don't know what book it is yet. The next book that I want to read in February is released in February. It comes out, now I have it the 16th of February, Waterstones has it the 18th of February, but it's in that week is The Galaxy and the Ground Within by Becky Chambers. This is the fourth book in the Wayfarer series and I have no, oh, I do have an idea of what it follows. Um, it follows a mother and a daughter who are aliens who live on an outpost planet and there's some form of lockdown and everybody who was on the outpost at the time is trapped there. Very excited for it, I love Becky Chambers, I love the Wayfarer series, I'm just really excited to read it, can't believe I get to read it next month, I've been excited about this since this time last year. And then the next book that I want to read in February is Hamnet by Maggie O'Farrell. So everybody has been loving this on booktube since it came out. My gran gave this to me for Christmas and so I'm very excited to read it. Oh that's a big old font, I love that. This is about William Shakespeare's son Hamnet who died but it's more about the mother and her grief, I believe. I don't know, I'll let you know when I've read it what it's more about. If you follow my channel for a while, you'll know that I have a bit of a problem with the online library where I'll just merrily download as many books as possible from the library to uh, not read or read, depending on how my month goes. The next book that I want to read in February is Severance by Ling Ma. So this is <laughs> kind of a weird book to be reading in our current times, but maybe I'll enjoy it. So this is a story about a apocalypse that has been caused by a pandemic, so that's great. It's quite a short book, um, so I think I'll be all right reading it. And also I do believe that this is a zombie apocalypse story. I heard about this, I think initially from Emma from Drinking By Myself, but it might be uh, on book break. I don't know, I just remember her voice telling me about it and I immediately downloaded it because I got excited. It seems interesting. I'm gonna give it a go. I'll see how I feel about it whilst I'm reading it. You gotta play it by ear about whether you're having fun reading the book or whether you're very stressed and are about to buy an entire wilderness survival kit off of the internet. The next book that I have on my February TBR, I love how many books I have on my February TBR with the fact that I barely read anything in January because I was reading Fellowship of the Ring and I'm going to be reading The Two Towers and so I'll barely read anything in February but I've put all these books on because I do want to read them in February, I just don't know if I will. But the next book that I do want to read in February is The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue by V. E. Schwab. Again, this is another one that I've wanted to read since it came out and couldn't justify buying it in hardback and it finally came onto the library app and available to me. I believe this follows a girl in France who makes a deal with a little demon fella who uh, basically in that deal she lives forever but everyone will forget her. It sounds fun, I like V. Schwab, I enjoyed the Shades of Magic series when I read them a couple of years ago so I'm excited to read something by her again and I hope I like it because I do think it could go either way with this book whether I really really love it or whether it's something that <laughs> I decide is not for me but it's good that I have it 
out from the e-library because I don't even have to go back to the library if I don't like it. I can just click return and be like, bye, get out of my life. That's all of the books I want to read in February. Let me know which books you want to read in February and let me know if you've read any of these books and what you thought of them. I am excited to see if other people loved or hated what I'm reading. The one I'm most excited for, aside from my Mr. Bees because I love a surprise every month, is Galaxy, obviously. I'm so excited. I already have it pre-ordered from Waterstones. Okay, well, have a fun month, uh, have a nice life, I'll see you in my next video, goodbye.